Let's hear what this sounds like. Welcome to my first ever uh, night moto vlog. Uh, going up to Walmart. Uh, that direction. Uh, get some printer ink and some pa printer paper. I'm making some flyers for my YouTube channel. Warm up the old tires real quick. But yeah, that's like a nice 70, 75 out. Real nice. For Colorado, that's awesome. So yeah, this is a... Uh, gonna be an interesting motor vlog. Man, it's gonna be a fun one. Yep, so let's see, see by, let's see, I don't know if you can see the clock, but right now it is uh, nine till one. And that is one in the morning. I just got off work. <laughs> and then, uh, do this, go up to get printer paper and ink, and then probably head home, start the Photoshop document for the flyers, and then probably head to bed. Um, then wake back up at 7 and go back to work at 2. Yeah. So that's what my uh, days consist of. Uh, yeah. Get off work super late. And then I uh, get up early. I like, I like to think of it as early. So I can do things before I go to work. Another fellow motorcycle. Sweet. Nope. No cop there. Awesome. Go this way. Here's the golf course. Man, it's a beautiful night out. I love it. This is like the best way to end my night. Or, it wouldn't be night anymore. It's my morning. Best way to start my morning. Yeah. Fire truck. That's probably. Nope. Just fire truck. So, yeah, something interesting happened today at work. Oh, gosh. So, um, there's. It was uh, fairly busy in the kitchen, but like outside the kitchen, it wasn't that busy. But yeah, so we're uh, all on the line cooking for food and everything with the lights going. We have our uh, AC going to keep it cool in there. Um, we're out of are walking for some reason. Uh, the condenser wasn't working very well. But and then we're all on the line. We're getting tickets in and everything. I'm pulling, reading them, uh, cutting food, and all of a sudden, all lights turn off. It goes completely black. And I mean, like, it, every, all the lights turn off, all the hood vents turn off, um, all of our shams and everything, our AC turns off, everything. It is dead quiet in the kitchen. And that happened twice, uh, twice. Yeah, it happened twice today. And the reason why is uh, our, uh, was our breaker for the, the main breaker, the, it gets super hot. And it's in a room that has no air circulation, so it just heats up. But yeah, it just is really weird. It was a little freaky. Just everything's going, we're all doing fine, we're working, all of a sudden, boom! Nothing. It's black, everything's off. It was real weird. Man, I want to be on the highway right now. I feel like being a speed demon right now, but I don't want to be a speed demon. I can't see where the cops are, and I don't want to run from the cops. Awesome. Sucks for you. Go park next to the bikes. Yeah. Let's see. Nice bike, man. Nice bike, man. Hey, thanks, Justin. Nice to meet you. Blake. Blake. You live around here? Or? Uh, up in Frederick. Oh, okay. Yeah. I just got it, actually. It dumped it last week. Oh, dang. I fucked up my carrings and stuff, but then I just stopped in here because I see that was running low on oil coming down the highway. Mm-hmm. 
started heating up really bad. So, uh oh. You know, I, like, I knew something was wrong, so. You checked the radiator level? Huh? You checked the radiator level? Uh oh. Let's see. Um. Uh, it's carbureted. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. You've got a radiator. Let's see. Uh, might be on the other side. Huh. There should be a reservoir somewhere on here. What year is it? 2000. Okay. Yeah, it's older, but. Yeah. I got it for 1500 bucks. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's why I was like, yeah, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> That's all right. I'll just take, I'm getting ready to take it to Kawasaki and mm -hmm. get it redone. But yeah, they're real good people there. Yeah, they're, they're awesome, man. Yeah. I, uh, somebody clipped me and busted these brackets off right here. Oh. To get the part. So I just had to let it sit there and, you know, obviously starting to be like, oh, how much? Yeah. Dang. <laughs> Sounds nice. It's, it's a ZX6R. Okay. I got a 2016 ZX6R. Yeah, it's a 636? Yep. That's, that's yeah, what I that's want. A, that's a good race bike right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's quick. <laughs> I've always been a Yamaha guy on the racetrack, but like the Suzuki. Not as much as on the street, but it's a Suzuki. Yeah. What, what you Dang. Want? <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's awesome. Chris Fairbanks? Okay. Hey, thank you. You too. Have a good night. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing after this? Uh, probably heading back. Probably take back roads back. Are you? Yeah. I'm going to probably go have a beer or something. So. Yeah. Dang. Seven months till I can drink. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, if you're ever around or something, man, and you want a buddy to go ride with, let me know. Okay. I mean, I don't have anybody. Like, I just moved up to Longmont about a month. Oh, dang, dude. About two weeks ago. Yeah. I'm still even trying to figure out where everything's at. And, you know. Okay. Channel 2, I do moto vlogs. Oh, no. Yeah. You do, huh? Yeah. What is, what is it? It's, I was uh, watching that Walter Riffick guy. Yeah, he's awesome. I wanted to, <laughs> he came to Colorado, and I was yep. trying to ride with him. He's up in, uh... Oh, did you comment on the video? Yeah. I think, yeah, I think I saw your comment. It was like, well, like, I wish you, were, like, I wish you would have known you were here or something yeah. like that. Yeah, it was up, like, uh, way up there by Pikes Peak. Yeah, I wish I would have known, though. <laughs> that looked like a dope little ride he was doing. Yeah. And then I guess he met up with you. Huh. What is it? What's your vlog name? What's your name again? Blake. Blake? Yeah. Justin, bro. Nice to meet you, man. Me too. <laughs> it's always cool to meet a fellow... subscriber on the channel and it's awesome so well, hopefully you can hear me all right 90 bucks gone got some printer paper got uh, all the ink cartridges and some scotch guard I thought it'd be pretty cool uh, to scotch guard all the flyers that are going to be hanging up outside and that way they're waterproof I thought it was pretty cool, pretty cool idea right there alright now this is what I don't like at night is uh, stopping in a complete in complete darkness like this I hate this I feel like there's going to be someone running up and uh, and get me 
But it's pretty la relaxing riding at night. I like it. No traffic. I gotta watch my speed though. Well, it is officially almost uh, two in the morning. Dang. But yeah, like, if there's anything, and I mean anything, that I could do better in my videos, or you'd want me, or um, or you want to see me do, just comment down below or send me a message. I would love to hear those. Just like anything, any feedback. Because I'm still getting used, I know, I'm still getting used to the fact of talking to myself. It's a little weird. But I, I guess I used to do that uh, while, a long time ago, though, talk to myself. Um, I'll get into that in another day. But yeah, woo. Say like a rabbit or a squirrel or something. But did not want to hit that. Yeah, here, um, I think in the next couple weeks, I'm going to be getting um, Defender Eliminator kit. I'm going to order that. And then uh, get my plates for the bike. I'm excited. First modification on the bike, I'd say. This bike scary fast. But it's just so much fun. It's just so much power. There's oh, the feeling of it just uh, taking off and it just keeps pulling. Oh, it's just awesome. Well, like the video if you liked it. Dislike if you didn't. Comment down below anything you loved about the video. Uh, we'll start a discussion. Love coming back to your guys' comments. Um, share the video all you want. Please share it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe for more awesomeness. Thank you. Have a good day.